Planet of Exile is a 1966 science fiction novel by American writer Ursula K. Le Guin, part of her Hainish cycle. It was first published as an ace double following the Tete Beach format, bundled with Mankind Under the Leash by Thomas M. Disk. In 2017, the rights for a movie have been acquired by Los Angeles Media Fund. Topic. Plot summary The story is set on Weryl, the third planet of the Gamma Draconis system. The planet has an orbital period of 60 Earth years, and is approaching its correspondingly long winter. The main characters belong to one of two major groups, Wald and his daughter Rollery are members of the Tevarans, a tribe of humanoid extraterrestrial indigenous to the planet. Jakob Agat is a young man from a dwindling colony of Earth humans that have been effectively marooned on the planet. Although both populations share a common genetic heritage in the Hainish people, the difference is significant enough to prevent interbreeding. The relationship between the two groups has long been tense and characterized by limited interaction. However, with the approaching dangers of winter and marauders, the visit of curious young Rollery to the colony becomes a sign of coming changes. Topic. Main characters Alla Pasfel, a member in the council of the colonist city of Landin. She is a frail elder but wise and sharp-witted. The Gaal, nomadic native tribes who migrate south during the harsh winter. They share a common language with the Tevarans. Jakob Agat Alterra, the de facto leader of the council in Landin. He is a middle-aged, wise man, who, like all colonists, has bluish-black skin. Rollery, the protagonist of the story and a native of the planet. She has a precocious and independent spirit, and remains single, largely as a consequence of being born out of season. Like the natives of Teva, she is light-skinned with golden eyes. She has the rare ability of mind speech. Seiko Esmit, the last member of a great family line who lives in Landin. She is a middle-aged, delicate and nervous woman. Uquet, one of Wald's grandsons who happens to be older than Umaxuman. He ambushes Jakob Agat but is later killed in a duel with Umaxuman. Umaxuman, one of Wald's spring-born sons who enjoys war and battle. Wadik, an all-terran bone setter who works alongside Rollery to tend to those injured in battle. Wald, Rollery's father. He is a wise, willful, and misogynistic tribal elder in the city of Teva. Topic: <inaudible> Native fauna. Han, sheep-like animals that are domesticated to provide food and clothing for the Tevarans and the citizens of Landin. Snogul, tall, thin, white-furred creatures with long necks that sway from side to side. They possess short but powerful clawed forearms and large snapping mouths lined with sharp teeth. They are quick, deadly, and hunt in packs. Stormbringer, taloned, pure white birds with silver eyes and a wingspan larger than a man's height. Their appearance in a southward migration signals the coming of winter. Topic. Role in the Hainish cycle The peoples of the various worlds in Legin's space fiction are descendants of an ancient settlement from Hain. For example, the Gethinians of the Left Hand of Darkness are believed to have been genetically engineered, as are several other peoples in the League of All Worlds. No such mention of genetic engineering of the Alterans Hainish derived predecessors is made in the story. In City of Illusions the descendants of the mixed Terrans and Teverians described in this story rescue Earth Terra from alien conquerors who have the unexpected ability to mind lie, which they use to telepathically conquer planets in the League of All Worlds, so this story is the backstory to City of Illusions. The reunification of the League as the Ecumen is mentioned in the left hand of darkness, but no story so far published has given any details of the climax of the conflict. A different planet, also called Weryl, in Four Ways to Forgiveness, is a completely different world from the planet of the Alterans described in this story. The common word for world in the languages of both planets is Weryl, hence their common names just mean the world. <laughs> <laughs> Literary significance and criticism 
One science fiction scholar points out that Planet of Exile, along with Rokanan's world and City of Illusions exhibits Legin's struggle as an emerging writer to arrive at a plausible, uniquely memorable and straightforward locale for her stories. Topic publication history Planet of Exile was initially published with no introduction, but Legin wrote an introduction for Harper and Rowe's 1978 hardcover edition. Planet of Exile was also reissued in 1978 along with Rokanan's World and City of Illusions in a volume called Three Hainish Novels and in 1996 with the same novels in a volume called Worlds of Exile and Illusion. Translations Russian. Planeta Iznyanya. Planet of Exile. 1980, 1992, 1993, 1997, 1999, 2006 Serbian, Planeta Iznanstva, published by Narodna Njiga, Partizanska Njiga Beograd, 1987 Italian, Il Pianeta dell'Asilio German, Das Zent Jahr. The Tenth Year German by Birgit Re Bohusch, no obvious translation problems in my source, Hainish, Hain 06, 7035, ISBN 3-453-21347-5 Ubrabatiti Neuors Gabe 2002, INCL Rokanen, Exile, Illusions Finnish, Mountpakalaisten Planeta, translated by Jerky Ivonen, published by Avane, 2011 Estonian, Rokanoni Marilm, Pagendus Plainy, translated by Karan Kara, Krista Kara, published by Varak, 2002, ISBN 9985305248. Dutch, Borlings Plainy, translated by T. Vos Darman von Buchholz, published by Het Spectrum, 1973. Planeta Exilu, Czech edition, 